Hey everyone, my name is Michael. Welcome back to the channel. This is Learning FPV with me. Let's get right into it. But the first controller which we're going to do is the Xbox controller. So Xbox One and up. So you're going to take your Xbox controller, you're going to take a micro USB cable which plugs into the back. You're going to plug that in. So we're going to come over here to settings. We're going to click controller setup. So it now knows that I have an Xbox, which is fantastic. Um, and we're going to click quick cl calibration. So make sure your sticks are centralized. They are centralized. Um, so just before going to that, so on the on the right hand side here, you can see the little drone. And on the left hand side is the controller. This is what it's going to show you on this side, what you need to do. You need to copy these moves. And on this side, it's good and important to look at because you'll be able to kind of see if it's reacting the correct ways, which will come in later when we need to invert the controls if it didn't pick it up correctly. So we're gonna go calibrate, centralize the sticks. We're gonna leave it. Great, rotate the sticks to filter. So we're gonna turn them around. Yeah, we're gonna throttle the stick up. Yep, yaw, so we're gonna use that. Pitch, we're gonna pitch forward. Roll, fantastic restart button drone reset fantastic okay cool so that part's done that's fantastic now that same method is the same on um the con on the on the on this exactly the same it's the same on every any other controller um so I, we'll get to that in a second now the thing that's important to look at so any of these controllers is before we get into too much detail you want to make sure that all this stuff is correct so on the left on the left hand stick uh the left hand stick over here when you push up the drone needs to go upwards when you pull it down you want to see that throttle goes in the opposite direction so you can see that green line over there then you want to test the the yaw so you move it to the left you want the drone the left stick you move it to the left you want the drone to your left you turn it to the right you want it to your right so it looks like that's doing the right thing then we want to check pitch so we're going to push it forward fantastic pull it back fantastic working roll everything looks like it's fine so in this case we don't need to invert anything we'll click save and uh now we're going to be ready to fly I'll show you now so i have an xbox controller in and you'll see on the screen we fly up yeah yeah fantastic yeah so we're all good we're flying and we'll uh not a very good landing but hey we're here Great, so now the things that I want to talk about quickly with our controller that don't quite work with the simulator and they don't match up with how a normal remote or transmitter works. So let's quickly talk about a normal transmitter. So that has two, um, two gimbals or two sticks on either side. One of them, depending on which mode you choose, which we'll get into in a different video, but this is a mode two controller. So the left hand stick is the throttle stick. And if you can see in here, it is able to stop in a certain place right now if you're familiar with an xbox controller it can't do that right so the sticks always auto return to the middle now this doesn't do that the throttle one specifically the other one does so the gimbal on this side will return to the middle but this one won't return to the middle so that's the differences and that's where kind of practicing with this kind of not set you up for bad habits but um if you practice with that for a really long time it, it's difficult to move over to these controllers which is what i actually found so i had this for i don't know about a, a week probably before i got an actual um transmitter so uh it was very difficult very difficult it's not the wrong word it was a little bit difficult for me to change over but at least i had the basics down um cool so enough babbling uh nice to see you guys and i'll see you around bye Thank you.